newly rediscovered photos raising questions about Amelia Earhart's disappearance. New documentaries renewing conversations about the Atchison, Kansas pilot's crash landing in the Pacific. KQ2's Brooke Anderson talks to some Atchison residents about their thoughts on the 80-year-old photo. In July 1937, Amelia Earhart's plane vanished, and many experts believe she'd crashed and died in the Pacific Ocean. Weeks of search activities produced no clues. Amelia Earhart was gone. Now, a newly released 80-year-old photo shows Earhart and her navigator, Fred Noonan, may have survived the crash after all. Uh, you know, I think the, the first initial reaction um, with me is always a little bit of skepticism, only because there have been so many things like this over the years. The History Channel is reporting the photo supports a theory that suggests Earhart landed on the Marshall Islands and was taken prisoner by the Japanese military on the island of Saipan. There's been a lot of rumors uh, through the years about Amelia being taken, so uh, the story fits with that, but I'd like to see some more evidence. But Prejean said this is a story she has heard before from a friend whose family is from Saipan. We can't remember if it was her grandmother, maybe it was an aunt, uh, who is, she is from Saipan, and um, who told her uh, when she was very young that there was this Caucasian lady and that they thought it might have been Amelia Earhart. Unfortunately, this story doesn't have a happy ending either. That story was that this lady, whoever this lady was, died of dysentery. And while it doesn't prove the new theory, it does have some Earhart experts questioning what they believe these past 80 years. I do definitely think it could be her in the picture, but... I always thought she, they went down north and west into the ocean. So it's going to change my theory if it happens. Many people say they aren't sure if they want to find out the truth because they enjoy the mystery that surrounds Amelia Earhart. You know, it's funny. I don't know that I really want them to figure it out because the mystery is so much fun. You know, personally, I've always said I hope they never figure it out because I like the mystery that surrounds her. But, but there are a whole lot of people who want to know. So. <laughs> That was KQ2's Brooke Anderson. The History Channel documentary Amelia Earhart, The Lost Evidence will air on Sunday.